welcome back to another video here in the channel this time around it, it, it's become a yearly thing yearly thing here we are going to be simming the stanley cup playoffs uh on nhl on nhl game so let's see what ea can do this year See who wins the cup according to them. So as you see here, matchups. Very, very, very good matchups. Very, very tight. I'm very excited for these playoffs, man. Uh Panthers, the President's Trophy winners. Playing the eighth seed right here. Tampa, Toronto, gonna be a high high scoring series for sure. Carolina Boston gonna be tough and gritty. Rangers and Penguins. It's gonna be. It, it's it, it's it's gonna be very very interesting this series right here. Uh, Edmonton, L.A. L.A. finally making it. Edmonton, pressure to win a series. Come on. Uh, Calgary. Calgary and Dallas. Uh, Minnesota and St. Louis. That's that's gonna be probably the best series. And Colorado and Nashville. So, also what I did with the lines, uh, I set everything up to what they are right now. So, Soros is not playing for the, uh, the, uh, he's not playing there for the, you know, for, for the Predators because he's injured and he's probably out, he's probably out for the season. So, first game, first game here, Colorado. Again, probably the most lopsided series. But let's jump in here on, on real-time sim for the first game here. First game, uh, first period. one nothing Nashville. Luke Coonan. Okay. Second period. Gabriel Landeskog is going to tie it up. Again, by the way, Landeskog, he might play game one. So I put him in just in case. JT Comfer on the power play. So that's going to be 2-1. A little bit less lopsided for first game here. Uh, considering David Riddick is in net. And he is bad. Uh, Kadri got an empty netter. And that's going to seal it. So Colorado takes the 1-0 lead. Nothing crazy for game 1 here. Nothing crazy. So let's just start simming here. Calgary takes the 1-0 series lead. Florida takes the 1-0 series lead here. Carolina-Boston. Boston takes the 1-0 lead. St. Louis going to take the 1-0 lead. Edmonton is going to take the 1-0 lead. Toronto is going to take the 1-0 lead here. Pittsburgh is going to take the 1-0 lead. Game 2 is now. Uh, Nashville is going to tie it. Okay. Calgary with the 2-0 lead. The Capitals tied up. Carolina ties it up. Minnesota ties it up. LA ties it up too. Tampa ties it up as well. Have a lot of tie series. Again, look how tight it is. There's only one series that's 2-0. Colorado takes a 2-1 lead here. Okay, 2-1 series right there. 2-1 for, for Florida. 2-1 for Boston. 2-1 for Minnesota. They win two in a row. 2-1 for Edmonton. 2-1 for Tampa. 2-1 for Pittsburgh. Let's see if we can take the 3-1 lead. Yes, Colorado takes the 3-1 lead in the series. And same for Calgary. Okay, so Florida has it right here. 2-2. Two 2-2 -two. Two -two between Carolina and Boston. So that's the closest series next to Minnesota and St. Louis. Can LA tie it up here? They can. Again, tight playoffs. Toronto ties it up as well. 2-2. Two -two. Most of the series are 2-2 two -two across the board. Okay, so so you have Nashville avoiding elimination here. Same for Dallas. 
Same for Washington. God. Boston gonna kick, is going to take the the 3-2 lead here. Wait. What other did I say? Oh, St. Louis takes a 3-2 lead. Edmonton takes a th the 3-2 lead. Tampa takes a 3-2 lead. The Rangers win two in a row here. So a lot of 3-2 series. Colorado takes it in six. Oh, the Stars come back from 3-1. The Capitals come back from 3-1-2. From three, the Bruins ended in six. So Minnesota tied it up. Let's see if Edmonton can end it. They do. 4-2. Can Tampa Bay end it? No, it goes to game seven. Can the Rangers end it? No, it goes another game seven. Okay, game seven right here. We have a bunch of game sevens. Every series ended, is going to end at either six games or seven. When I said all of these series are going to be tight, I was not lying. Noah Hannafin is going to take the one nothing lead here for the Flames. I'm just assuming the rest of the first period here. 2 nothing lead. Second period. 3-1 lead. Okay, 3-1 lead coming into the third period. Calgary, are you going to choke that or will you hold on? <laughs> because uh, if you choke that 3-1 lead in the game and in the series, bro, uh, you're never going to hear the end of it. And they're able to advance. You'll love to see it. So Calgary advances to the second round. Uh, Boston with the upset. That's the only upset here. There, there aren't any other upsets here. Uh, well, there's a potential one here. With the, the, uh, the Capitals. So first period... 2-1 for Florida. Second period, still 2-1. Uh, let's slow sim the second, uh, the third period. Connor Sheary is going to tie it up. Power play for Florida. Ooh, man. It looks like that might be the first overtime game. It looks like we no, Alex Ovechkin is gonna is gonna break the tie with four seconds left, and the Washington Capitals advance to the second round and upset the the President's Trophy winners in seven games. Oh no, that is not. Yeah, if, if I mean, if the Panthers lose in real life, you you'll never hear the end of it. Because they cannot, I mean, they really cannot lose after not winning a series at all. But, man, oh, man, oh, man, the Capitals, Alex Ovechkin, putting his team on, on his back. We have another Game 7 here. First period in Minnesota, 2-1. Second period, 3-3. Three, three. Well, this was, expe oh, they Jordan Greenway scores right away, I guess. 40, literally 47 seconds in. Halfway through the third. Jacob Middleton. All right, 5-3. You're six minutes away from eliminating the Blues. Now three, can they hold on? Under two. And it looks like they do. The Minnesota Wild advance in seven games. In seven games. So here we go. Uh, that's the second last game seven. There are so many game sevens. There are so many game sevens. I mean, Toronto cannot lose. <laughs> of course. Second. So they have a lead after three, <laughs> after two. Let's see what happens. Tampa is dominating them in the shot column, by the way. The Leafs are trying to catch up. And it's, uh, oh my god, what's happening? 
Under five. They gave up a power play. Oh, no. The Tampa Bay Lightning have been knocked out. And... And that's a shutout. They've been shut out in Game 7 by Jack Campbell. So the Leafs finally advanced, finally went around, according to EA. Well, in a lot of EA Sims, they uh, they win a lot of rounds. They win a lot of the time. They go to like the third, fourth round. Uh, you know, the Leafs seem pretty well in this game. Rangers, Penguins, not looking very good. Andrew Kopp, Chris Kreider, and Artemi Panarin, and they look like all all power play goals. Well, that's how you lose to the Rangers. Don't give them power plays. And the Pittsburgh Penguins have not followed that at all. And that's how they're down in a crucial game. You can't be taking penalties. And and also, they're dominating the, the, the shot column here. It's really not like the, the Rangers are playing their best game. And they still won. Shesty shutout because he's too good. But... Penalties killed the Pittsburgh Penguins. All three goals in a power play. That is not how you win, especially a game seven here. But yeah, second round. Let's see what happens. Colorado takes a one nothing lead. Battle of Alberta. We have Calgary takes the one nothing lead. Toronto takes the one nothing lead. The Bruins take the one nothing lead. Two nothing for Colorado. 1-1, McDavid's band ties it. 2-0 for Toronto. 2-0 for Boston. Minnesota's in trouble here. 3-0. 2-1 for Calgary. 3-0. 3-0 lead for the Leafs. 3-0. Whoa. So we, we have three 3-0 three leads. All right, man. Can Colorado advance? They do. 3-1 for Calgary. Can the Leafs advance? Complete the sweep? No. 3-1. The Rangers take a game as well. 3-2. So, uh, they're back. <laughs> they're back in this. 3-2, man. Three teams getting... Okay. So, we see interesting series right here. Can the Flames finally end it? They do. Can the Leafs finally end it? They do as well. Can the Bruins finally end it? No, they go to a game seven. The only game seven in the series. So we're fine here. Oh boy, the, Bru the Bruins surge with three goals in the first period. And they add on a fourth. Whoa, that is not good. That is not good for the Rangers. They did all this coming back. Just for them to get crushed at home. Frank, Frank Vitrano is going to score right here. 5-1. Connor Clifton. And yeah, man. That was it. That is it for the run for the Rangers right here. Uh, they win. I mean, they have two game sevens. Okay, Colorado against Calgary, Toronto, Boston. Oh, boy. Colorado takes game one. Boston takes game one. Colorado, Colorado take, takes game two. Boston takes, takes a 2 nothing lead here. 3 nothing for Colorado. 3 nothing for Boston. Can Colorado complete another sweep? They do. The Bruins sweep the Leafs, and it's going to be Bruins and Avalanche in the finals. The unexpected. Let's see what happens right here. The Bruins take the one nothing lead. Colorado ties it up. Colorado takes a 2-1 lead. 3-1 lead. I'm going to jump into every game now. First period, 2-0 Colorado. Second period, 4-1. Let's sim out the rest of this. And, uh, I'll, you know, I, I'm, I'm going to jump.
uh, why not take a jump onto the ice and see uh, Nathan McKinnon possibly hoist a cup at home? Yeah, uh, that's at home. I was trying to check, bro. Alrighty. So, yeah, uh, all of this done with my custom rosters. You'll love to see it. You'll love to see it. Uh, you know. So, uh, here we go. Okay, I finally got that. Oh, never mind. Never mind. And by the way, by the time I do this, I can show you guys the X factors if you want in my build. Uh, wait a sec. I got to just switch that real quick. Visual settings. Here I go. And I'm going to show you guys the X factors in my build. No, that's not what I wanted to do. EA, come on. We ought to move fast. We ought to move fast here. Okay, so Colorado. Here are the guys right here. If you watch, you can pause the video, whatever you want. Yeah, I mean, Logan O'Connor's not... I don't think he's playing. Uh, just, same for New Hook. So Sturm, all these guys. Boston, Bergeron, Coyle, Foligno, all Halla, okay, Marchand, McAvoy. For some reason, doesn't have a picture. He's one of the best D-men in the league. Uh, Pasternak, Carlo, DeBrusque. All right, all these guys, all these little guys here, you know, all these guys. For those who wanted to know. Now, let's check the last instance instances here. Oh, Gerard. No sack to Foligno. Foligno coughs it up. Kadri, saved by Ulmark. Oh, and they almost scored another goal here. Almost scored a fifth. A massive, massive cough up by uh, Foligno. Oh, save. Alrighty. Yeah, man, the building, in the building. The Stanley Cup's in the building. Up, man. Oh, save. Uh, no, not a save. But he misses the net. Marshan. Shot. I think he hit the post. Another shot right there. And that's how you win. Co EA decided that the Colorado Avalanche are going to win the cup. We have them facing the Bruins. Yeah, I love to see it. And that's the team I have winning the cup, by the way. That's exactly the team I have winning the cup. So I, I wouldn't be surprised at all. Love to see it. Love to see it.
Miko Ranton is the playoff MVP here. Conn Smythe winner. All righty. Oh, Gabriel Landeskog. Nazim Kadri. Who is that? Oh, come on. Oh, Eric Johnson. But the guy has had health issues for for, for for a long time. Recently. So happy for him. Happy for him. Darcy Kemper in his first year with Colorado. The ceremonial team picture. I still think of Brian Trotsky with the Penguins sprawled out after all those years. The veteran. Uh, so, hard, so hard to get to. Yeah. He was so all right, man. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Tell me, you guys, uh, your response. Uh, your results. Oh, response. Results. And, uh, yeah, man. Hope you enjoyed Strider for your new and comment down below. And yeah, I'm out.